Hello, this is Wes with Baron Heating Company and BaronGreenTeam.com. I got a new method of filming here with me in the picture. It's gonna be great. This is a reaction video, so I have not seen this system. Um, we installed in this house uh, a six zone RMXS Daikin Super Multi 11.3 HSPF system. It has four heads and two concealed units in this house. Uh, when you look at this house, this is, this is a bedroom wing that's a zone. Behind that is a, is a main living area that's a zone. Over here is a pool room, like billiards room, that's a zone. And then there's a basement under here with a bedroom wing, a family room, and a son's room under that. So that's our three zones. The two concealed zones are the bedroom sides. Um, but what's awesome is that this, you're gonna see, I'm seeing this for the first time, it's very exciting. Uh, I've got Chris and Jacoby to thank for this probably <laughs> gonna be a work of art, I imagine. Um, and really a shout out to Baron Heating. I am just a cog in a machine that creates this kind of work and this kind of passion. Um, my excitement for this is a reflection of our ownership, John Barron, and um, just a big shout out to Baron Heating and just awesome. I'm in Bellevue, Washington today. This is a customer's house who found us on YouTube, uh, watched my videos and wanted that level of quality and professionalism and quality control and service. And so here we go. So um, I'm gonna take you to the outdoor unit first. Over on this side of the house. Oh, my arm's gonna get sore holding it out this far, but. So one of the things you gotta be careful of is things like noise volume at lot line. So the ductless is perfect for that. Oh, there it is. I love the arm excess. I love how big it is. I love things like that. But here we go. So here we have, now we have a zone on. So you can hear these things running, trying to catch up that zone. Had it pretty cold in there, so we're turning on the heat. Um, so when you look at and you see these large feet, that's what we use for the larger units, just because you can't put them on the little feet and then we want to also bracket, you know, brace the system. So in this case, what you're seeing here is you're seeing, we have our one line. So the Arm XS is real awesome and then it has one line that runs out from the unit and then it's gonna take a path into the mechanical room, which I'm so excited to see. And hopefully uh, Chris and Jacoby get to see this because I'm just, their work is just amazing. So we have a nice straight system that's getting us into the mechanical room. And then that's where we're gonna have our branch boxes. And then from there, we're coming back out to feed a couple zones over here. So we have this line runs up. This is our main uh, living area one. And then, we come out and that continues on and comes around and that's where we're going to our uh, family room downstairs. So, I'll get it close again so you can hear it. Or not hear it. Here we go, okay. So let's head inside, this looks great. I love nice, clean, speedy channel. One of the things that we wanted, uh, that we were worried about was things like this. So check this out. So we just wanted to make sure that we get a nice flat rise. We didn't want to have this thing all twisted. So it was easier to run along the flat line here, but we used a little piece of uh, flex speedy to get us to into that you know horizontal uh, flat mode. And we just wanted to make sure that everything stayed nice and copacetic. So we engineered that. We were worried about, we caulked everything. So everything stays nice and clean. We have electrical in there. And we also have our thermostat wiring in there. So that's gonna be important. Uh, one other thing I'm going to show you is on the other side of the house, um, one of the best line set routings ever was I actually, there was no crawl space under this other section, so I used, we had a duct that ran out to the side, and so I used, we used that to, to get up in there. And so here we have, we're coming out the rim. Again, we wanted to be as clean and flat as possible, so we used um, our uh, flashing there made ourselves a nice connector box here. Condensate's coming out the side. Um, and so you can get a clean look at that. And then we'll just stay outside here and I'll show you some of the other speedy channel. Oop. 